Okay, hello everyone. Connor here again. Another Binding of Isaac video. Uh, I just uploaded two more. Uh, let's plays of the Battlefield 4. My let's play. And I kind of uploaded my first Binding of Isaac video very early and then I kind of did as a test and I didn't, I mean, I wasn't talking at all so just kind of just like the same sort of talking. And I've played this a lot before. I almost got to the chest, which is when I was reading the game. But I didn't, so I just I decided to restart just put the play on here and do a let's play. So I hope we do good this time. Eh, but there's the puberty, pills, do nothing. So actually, yeah, I'm gonna explain the game a little bit more so what you do is you basically there's like six characters I think and you have Isaac at the start who's this lying right now and you go into rooms and then you shoot you shoot tears at enemies and there's tons of different items and there's like 300 something that you can get that you can use to um they affect everything from your look like your movement to your tears to just about everything pretty much. These are pills which are just a drop you can get and they have a random effect so since till the end this gives me three kamikaze flies which will when I see it will then they'll like walk into an enemy and go hit it and they'll do two times my base damage which is I think Isaac is just one damage is one to start. Some of the other characters have different starting, um, different starting values. So here's Bomb Kid, or Boom. But um, this gives me 10, uh, 10 bombs, which you can see up, up here. There's coins, bombs, and keys, and keys light open treasure rooms, shops, treasure chests, like that. Okay, here's a mini box. So. You can drop an item. Ah. There you go. Didn't drop an item, you drop a key and a soul heart, which see hearts in the here are my hearts, starting hearts, and here is the soul heart. Hearts you can if you lose them you can refill by picking up this heart container. But soul hearts are just a temporary one, so once you lose them you can't get them back, they're they're gone. So this is oh shoot. See, see my soul heart like halfway, half a heart down. Once I get hit one more time oh. once I get hit one more time then it'll go away and I won't be able to get it back by picking heart damage. So here's a tinted rock, see how it's darker than the rest right here. There's a tinted rock right here. There's a regular rock. And they have like one in 90 chance to spawn them or something. I don't know the exact one, but you can blow it up with a. Sorry about that, my phone. Uh, you can blow it up with a bomb, and you'll get. You'll get. There's a troll bomb. That can actually but See, I got a soul heart. You usually get one to two soul hearts, and there's one item you can get, which is a small rock, which increases your damage. So here we'll be fighting a small here will be fighting the kingdom over Ah! Here will be fighting Pin, which is pretty fairly easy box to just stand on one side and just keep hitting him. It'd be nice if you can get a health up from him. A health up increases a red heart capacity, so like, you'll have four. So we'll be able to get back four hearts instead of just three. And one soul heart. Temporary. Guys, so let me just kill him. Usually these runs take about 30 to 30 minutes to an hour actually. You get a good one, but if you lose like my last one, then it's like 17 minutes. And, ooh, so this, this is stem cell. And what this does is it gives you a health up, but it also increases shot speed. My shots are a little faster, which every I don't know. I don't really like shot speed because it. 
it like not makes it it makes knockback more, which isn't really good because you wanna be able to land your shots more. But uh, I guess the health up's it's worth it for the health up unless you're really fun in the game and you don't need it. But yeah, so here we're gonna eternal heart. What eternal heart does when you see up here, like half light has gone. Oh shoot, I pressed it. <laughs> a bomb. But um what this is when I go to the next floor right here, it will it will um it will turn into a, a heart container. So I basically got two health at this floor. Which is really great actually for the first floor. See right there it turned into a heart container, so now another heart container. Oh this is not good. Okay, damage. Yeah. Yeah, this is this fire will shoot out. Oh yeah, always shoot the fires and the poops. They'll give you coins, some rarely they'll give you items and stuff. But most of you stuff so there's a champion enemy which are usually stronger in some way better than the regular ones. They spawn I don't know if their chance to spawn is but there's a regular version of that. I don't know what it's called. Okay, so here's a So yeah, here's a item room which is on the last floor where I got the bomb. And the first shoot, the first floor it's it's just open, but on the second through second floor up it's um it costs one coin or one what am I talking about? One key. Oh crafting this crafting this guy. Craft key sky, so that's a use item which use items you can have one at a time. But passive items you can have as many as you want, like the health ups and stuff, and tier effects and everything. Cut this guy will bring out a random number of. Dang it! Oh, that was actually pretty helpful. Cut this guy will bring out a random number of beams of light, which hurts the enemies. I'll show you at the boss, but here's a secret room. There are two for four, okay, three cents. Oh my gosh, why is it That was just stupid. I was just stupid. So secret rooms they'll close after you've done it, but you open them with a bomb and they there's a top secret room and a secret room. Top secret room usually has um uh a uh machine, a what do you call them? Like uh it either has a slot machine, a health vendor thing. Hang on, I can't I'm sorry guys, I can't remember these cards. Or a like a or a fortune teller. That's what it is. And or they could have items, but it's very rarely they'll have items. So that was a sacrifice ring. Here I'll use crack in the sky. Ooh, I got him. So it did a, did a lot of damage to you, but um, what sacrifice rooms are is they are you can you when you go in them you lose half a heart and uh, at the Womb up, which is a later level, you'll lose full heart. Dang it! Lose a full heart, full heart. But you'll lose half heart going in, half heart going out. So this is a range up, mom's here. It's a range up, which is pretty good, but I, I would have liked the alpha. But second rest rooms, you get you get one to two red chests like you saw in there. And they can have guppy items, which when I get guppy items I'll talk about them which might be in here actually but they can turn into guppy which is really really good so and they can also have soul hearts spiders like you saw kamikaze flies or coins just about anything here this is a devil room devil rooms they spawn after you beat the boss in some places and they they have uh, on the first floor. Oops, on the first floor they um cannot spawn unless you are, or they can spawn. It's a very low chance though, and also you can increase your chances by um not taking any red heart damage. You can take soul heart damage, not red heart. Um, and what these do is there's two, so that these each have two hearts. So that means I'll lose two whole red heart up. So. Like, uh, you'll see, I'll lose through them. So here is the mark, which is damage up. Here is Guppy's head, which 
if you use a spacebar item, use that item for spacebar item. And what that does is it spawns two to five kamikaze flies, which is really good, but I'm gonna put the marker C in the top right. Or the mark also gives us a soul heart, but in the top right I only have three hearts now, three red hearts. So if I would take that I would have one red heart, which I don't think I'm gonna do, even though I really want it. That is really good. But the damage I've been playing with. But also for sacrifice rooms, I would not recommend them to new players. Ooh, they all play with this moment. I wouldn't recommend them to new players because it takes away your health. And in the beginning, I sucked really bad too, and I barely get past the first few floors. But yeah, so here is a Aces or Aces space. Yeah, this is a trinket, which in the top left you can see up here. Oh, you can also click the shoot. I'm using WASD to move and then the uh, up, left, right, down to shoot. But this is a trinket. So, what this does, like, there are little bonuses that you can get that help you. So, this one makes it an increased chance for um, card, cards to spawn, which are just like, sorry about that, excuse me, which are just like pills, but they, um, they have different effects. Here's Globins. One's a Gazing Globin, which is the one that's going faster right here that I'm playing right now. Has more health, runs faster, and it's smarter. And once you kill them, they go into a pile, and if you don't shoot it fast enough, you can kill it fast enough, they'll come back out. But they'll be easier to kill when they come back out. So right here is a challenge where you can go in, there's sometimes an item in there. And once you take it, um, this door will close right here. And since I like, if I open that, the door will close, and I have to fight three waves of enemies, which is fairly easy. But you know, like I said, oh shoot! If you're new, then it's not a good idea to do that. There you go. So that was Fistula of Boss, which. Bosses can spawn on regular regular rooms besides the boss room, but they won't drop items usually. And they're usually not as hard as bosses unless you get to the uh, cathedral and the chest. So look, I have another charge for my space bar item. Check this guy's a uh, five room charge. So here's a trick tip. Tip: If you go up on the top and stay on the top of the room, oh, wow, well, I just. That's really good. That's really good. So I just wasted a heart because <laughs> I did it twice on accident. But if you go to the top of a or sacrifice room, if you go to the top of a room, the flies usually come out to you most of the time. I'm not going to say all the time like some people, because I've been hit multiple times, like hundreds of times actually, right in. So what I got here, the sacrifice room, from the sacrifice room, which is really good, is, um, Spirit of Night, which is a devil room item, you can use a room, and also it helps, or it's flying, it's flight, see a little spirit right here, little spirit I can fly over the gaps, it's flight, and it's also spectral tier tiers, which, it, they'll fly over, see if I can find some, like, rocks and stuff, they'll fly over stuff, ah, that's bad damage. Fire the rocks and gaps and everything. This wet this item is really good. I'd recommend even picking up any delta because it's two bonus and okay. These guys are not fun. Ah my gosh, that's terrible. There's a boss in here. I'm gonna knock on the boss action and uh, no. I'll wait and go to the item first right here. So here is also a shop on the right, in the side room, which you'd need a key to open and for you can buy stuff for um you can buy stuff for for cents up here by the bombs and the keys. Um and usually there's a certain item pool in there. Like the this room can have ooh the matter. This room can have see it, the spectacles go over fire which makes it harder to destroy stuff. Takes a little bit longer. Come on. 
Okay, the miter is gonna. Oh yeah, so the shops. Um, you feel blessed. The shops you can buy. It has a certain item pool. I have fourteen pence. It usually costs ten to fifteen to usually fifteen to buy an item. So you can buy soul hearts. Shoot, regular hearts. Um, keys, bonds in there for a few cents each. But the miter, what this does is see this little aura around us. That's from the miter, and that um, that makes it a 50% chance that any regular heart drop, like red heart drop, is a soul heart, which is pretty good actually, because a lot of the time you have your full on health and you keep getting regular red hearts, and you can't use them, so this helps increase them to soul hearts, which is temporary. Okay, this is heat, I believe, which it's gonna be pretty easy since I have spectral tears, so I can just shoot him over here. Dang it, get him. Dang it. He's gonna fly up. Oh, that's not good. He's gonna jump around, poop out. Whatever that is, and shoot that, shoot tears at us. Ah, and have his eyes, after he gets to a certain health, his eyes will, um, his eyes will come out like this, and they do damage too, and then you can't kill him. Still him ah. And the good thing about Flight 2 is that, is that we're gonna be able to, oh my gosh, this is this is bad, I'm sorry guys, this is really bad. Wait, we're gonna be able to go over his poop that he shoots out, like the slime stuff. So here's pageant, there's a lot of blood over here. Here's pageant boy. This will get us 9, wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7 cents, but any one of those could be a dime or a nickel, which I just picked up a nickel. Nickel's 5 cents, dime is 10, obviously. Okay, this ring would be really hard. Since I have light, it's not very hard. These are chargers, they'll charge at you if they see you. They can be really annoying or they can be pretty easy. I hate these guys. Seems like my fire is gone now, which is tears. Gone now. Ooh, so that's good. He's gone down some. Ooh! That's an Igor, I think. Igor, which is, is a it's one it's a rare version of these. It's not a champion necessarily. It's a rare version of these, and it's like one in four hundred chance or something. It's like insane. It's a lot harder too, but it's cool to see. So here's a carrot card, which is not the Ace of Spades. That's not what it affects, but it's, it's a death will give us. Two times damage for I think. Oh my gosh. So these guys, you can only shoot them when they're up like that. But wait, there's a that's on tails, but there's nothing. Uh, so death, I'll keep that card. You can only keep one trinket, one space bar item, one. See the flight can get me there. One trinket, one space bar item, and one. Uh, carrot card, pill, drop item over there in the right hand corner. That's uh, speedy fly. So I'm gonna go back and get the. Actually, I'm gonna use here. I'm gonna do the fight the boss and then go to the item room. Ooh, Krampus. He's dead here. Krampus still splitting two. He's a, actually a... He gets on in the devil room. And... What he does is he'll spend two and then... It's actually pretty hard, but he'll drop. A lump of coal, ah, which is a really good item. Okay, I'm about to die. Oh my gosh! I don't 
don't die, don't die, don't die. Oh, I got it. So he'll drop a double room item usually, but if he's in the double room, he'll drop a lump of coal, which increases. I'll talk about that when we get it. Here's the pack. This is a double room item. This increases your damage and gives you soul heart strength. So my damage. Ooh, it looks like a fire rate went up too. My damage is pretty high now since I got the mark and the pack. Which is great. Great, great, great. Really good. Okay, TNT, don't give me them. Special tools make it really hard. You hit that. Come on. I know. Actually, you know what? I don't even need to hit it. I can just go fly right over him, but I like the board. Oh, pride. There's a mini boss. He can drop an item. So, let's get the fight for you. Okay, here's a tarot card again. Judgment. Let's spawn a demon beggar. Air, which, when you run into it, it'll take half a heart, which I'm gonna die, I die now. Half a heart and has a chance to give you an item. An item or like a coin or a key or a bomb. Which, if you have a lot of hearts, you can be really good, but there's also another one, just a beggar, which takes coins. You have a lot of coins right now. The beggar just takes coins. And... And what the coins do is... The beggar is the same chance as the demon beggar. It's the same. I think the demon beggar is a higher chance like dropping... Devil reminds if I'm correct. Ooh, that's not good, that's not good. That was a champion. I don't know what the name is. Champion. Just use back this guy, taking use of my... Uh... Re- or not re- Re-rolls. Veterans will understand what I mean, but... I can use my just easier and use it quicker. Yeah, I, ooh, is that in eye mom's contact or Kane's eye? I think that is mom's eye or inner eye. Or mom's contact or inner eye. Mom's contact. Or yeah, mom's. Oh no, it's mom's eye. That makes mom's contact appear in the basement. So, mom's eye, if you shoot out of the back, you have a chance to shoot out of the back of your head. Not 100%, so. Yeah. Just go and get my way back to the boss and bring us far. Actually, I'm gonna go to the shop, which probably will be greed of mini boss. No, it's not. Do I can buy a compass, which is pretty good. And yeah, compass. Uh, I'm not gonna buy the bomb. Compass shows us at the start of every or when we're on a floor where the main rooms are, so like the boss room, um, the item room, the shop, other big rooms like that. So we're almost to mom, which is the boss. Okay, that's a lot of enemies. My damage is pretty high, so we should be not. Ah. These guys aren't too hard to Ah! There's a pill. Friends in the end, that's good. Actually, I should have saved that for the boss. This is not such a push now. Ah, my gosh. I hate this one. Dang. I hate this room so much. Ooh, ooh, okay. Small rock. Ooh. Did I get a small rock? What happened? What happened? Yeah, I don't know how I got that. Maybe it was a tinted rock? I don't know what the heck. That was odd. Here's the devil, which is a good I'm going here. It's probably greed. Yep. Okay, no. I'm actually gonna use this. 
doubles our damage. When Greed hits us, he actually takes coins. He takes one coin and you drop two, one or two. The tower, okay. That just drops a bunch of bombs in here, which is actually really bad. I'm not gonna go from here, I'm gonna go straight to the boss and I don't even Cause my I'm not look not looking too good right now. Sorry guys, I couldn't like beat it and stuff on that. Still in it. Oh no 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 no. No 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 the key uh this is not looking good. Um got it. Oh, there we go. There are boom flies or something like that. Ooh, um, Rosary. That gives you a. Ooh, that gives you three soul hearts and a. Ooh, this is a slot machine. You can win stuff on it. Usually you don't win an item, but you win and stuff, but. The rosary gives you a eternal heart. Oh wait, no, that's ninety shade. Rosary just gives you three soul hearts. That's actually you can blow up slot machines and machines. It'll give you some stuff like that. Oh my gosh, the heart! This is a hard loss. It's ever to kill. Ah, it's hard too. You have to get behind him. When you kill this heart, because you have to. See, there's no health bar, which is odd. See, right now, if you get behind him, it's gonna take a while. No matter how fast you do it. You don't even get like a uh, like a specific item or anything from it. Just... Oh my gosh! I keep thinking he's gonna get. Go. I'm gonna. Oh my god! Super annoying. Got him there a few times. Got him again. I'm sure it's, oh, well, I guess I can't control this, so. Still, like, the, uh, it just takes forever, and unless you have certain items, it takes forever. Okay, la 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 la. So I should be. I'll do my next Finding My Eyes video tomorrow, as long as, as well as some other. I'm on break right now, so I I can upload a lot. Ah! Oh yeah, so I can upload a lot. I'll do Finding My Eyes a few more Battlefield videos, and hopefully the third one uploaded. It was stuck at said processing. Oh yes, finally. It said processing like. 94 and then it stopped, so I deleted it. I tried it again, it stopped at 95. And I guess I think it uploaded. Krampus, wow. So this is not good. I got Squeezy, which is Tears, which is really good though. Fire it faster and it gives you two soul hearts. Ooh. Primus does not spit split into two on like or like Dang, what's his name? The one we saw before. There we go, see, we got a lump of coal from Krampus. Which I'm yeah, I'm fine with it. Ooh, luck up. That increases chance. Uh -huh. I don't remember. Sorry, guys. 
but one of the pull increases. See how my tears get bigger as I go across the room? It increases your damage, like by how much they have your tears have traveled. So if they traveled for five seconds, and it's like two point some, two, three point some, three point five, I think. But it's never gonna travel five seconds unless you have Polyphemus or Sacred Heart, which slows down your tears. Oh, a library now. I don't want that. Actually, I didn't really fight down. Oh my gosh. So bad. So those brain goopy things leave a trail of oh, good. Leave a trail of slime, which I can fly over since I have flights, but they usually hurt you. All oh, these guys hate this guy. They like fire their heads at you and then when you kill them, they either their head comes off or their body. The head is going on there, so it shoots you. Air card. The fool, this teleports me to the farm or the item room. I'm not sure. I'm gonna try it right now because I know it's one of those two. So I know that. Ah, dang it! Because I know, because if it gets me into the. I don't know, that'd be good. Judgment. This means a uh, beggar. I got a, a nickel, which is great. So I'm gonna use pet play this beggar out because he could give you items. That's really good. Menu is cool. Come on. Oh my gosh. Give me a heart, which is good right now. Soul heart, which is really good. Also with the heart, you cannot have- Ooh, he gave me a uh, used item now. Wow. That sucks. It's just, if you use it, you can break one rock. Wow. That'll give me an HP up. I forgot to use the pool, but I can HP up. But you cannot have more than 12 red hearts, but you can have- Soul hearts off the screen, you can have unlimited soul hearts. It's not. I need to spin that. Oh, it takes you to spawn, so that wasn't that big a deal. Um, it takes you to your spawn room. Ooh, no. no. Ah! That was a champion jumper. I don't know what his name is, but he had to go to the boss. Oh my gosh, again? Same name? Are you kidding me? Dang! No! Oh my gosh! What is up with this? This is terrible. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, guys. You're doing so bad right now. Kind of rusty, but still, like, this is really bad play by me. We still might be able to beat. Organs. Oh, uh, let's go in here. We will buy the soul heart and the treasure. I'm selling in use because we're gonna be fighting mom. But, I uh, might as well. Change, slogan. Wait, what? Oh, it looked like my cheers were going over him. They were all over him. That was really good. Gazing grills in this is not good at all. I think we should be able to beat Mom here. Ooh. I 
Yeah, this is where you can kind of... His mother, fueled with the desire to serve her god, was bearing down on Isaac. I will do as I am told, my lord. I love you above all else, Isaac's mother repeated to herself. This was the end of the line for Isaac. His mother was far too strong for him. But just as he accepted his fate, God intervened sending an angel down from above to stop his mother's hand. And just like that, it was over. Here's the credits, which are pretty cool. They just show the developers stuff for a little bit, and then... This is a good one, but they show the developers for a little bit, and then they show the different enemies. Brain speed. Sack. It's a sack. Mask plus art. Ugh. The boss. Plus those mini ones of it, which are regular enemies, which are hard to kill too. Isaac. Okay guys, well thank you for watching. Bye.